Zach Halpin. And number 41, Nick Thomas. My name is Nick Thomas. I'm from Akron, Ohio. I came here on a scholarship for football as well as an academic scholarship in August of 2008. I just kind of remember disbelief, kind of like in shock, is what I remember from it. Tore my ACL as well as some meniscus damage. It was a pretty horrible pain, probably the worst I've ever had in my life. An ACL injury is tearing of the anterior cruciate ligament, which is the main stabilizing ligament in your knee. What it does is it actually prevents your knee from shifting forwards and backwards um, when, when it's not torn. And when it is torn, you have no stability in your knee. And um, that's essentially what happens. There are a litany of devices, exercise, equipment that we use, modalities that we use to get a student athlete or an athlete back um, from an ACL injury. Um, you know, we use a lot of ice, um, we use a lot of um, rehab exercises, um, you know, the, there's specific equipment that we do use to get our athletes back. One of uh, the pieces of equipment um, modalities that we use is called a game ready system. And essentially, game ready is a cryotherapy system where it circulates cold water through a sleeve that we wrap on the athlete's knee. Um, we can we can add some compression to decrease the swelling. On top of that, we can set the temperature to something therapeutic that's going to help decrease the swelling, inflammation, to help the athlete heal um, a little bit quicker. Um, it's, it's one of our favorite things to use and it's, it's very helpful in getting our student athletes back uh, on the field. Another piece of equipment that we use uh, to get our athletes back is the leg press. And that piece of equipment is probably one of our favorite pieces of equipment to use because it strengthens up the quads uh, to, to help stabilize the knee uh, when an athlete gets back to running. I think one of the things that definitely helped me in my rehab, I was kind of making my rehab like uh, like it was its own sport almost. Uh, I tried to, you know, challenge myself every day and try and beat my, you know, my best the week, the week before. Just tried to build every week and build on every day and get better every day by day. Uh, so just trying to make it a kind of a competition with myself to see how I could push myself on, on any given day. There were people that doubted if I could return to the field and if I did return, you know, if I could be effective in any way. Um, but, you know, I, I didn't let myself think that way. Uh, I always tried to ha always tried to be strong-minded as possible and be, be as positive as possible and not let, in, not let uh, any of those naysayers put that idea in my head. Last game was a, was a was a pretty emotional day. Uh, I think for all the seniors, um, me especially, you know, kind of going through that time where I was off the field, and then um, really being appreciative of, of all the thing that the that the guys had done for me, as well as my family, and kind of one day where I got to celebrate with all of them. Um, you know, walking out on the field and running through the tunnel, and then uh, going out to the 50-yard line, and meeting up with my parents. You know, it was a really it was a really special moment and uh, something that. Hopefully I'll remember for a long time.
think we have a lot of heart as a team. Uh, I think we care about each other a lot, and I think uh, the family atmosphere that we've built here at Wayne State uh, is something, a special characteristic of, of this team. Um, resiliency as well, you know, when things didn't go as well as planned, I think for the most part the guys stuck together uh, and tried to fight as much as they could. Last game, it was a disappointing result with the end result being a loss. Um, and especially with all the, the emotions going through it, being the last time I was going to wear a Wayne State uniform and the last time playing on our home field. Um, it was definitely an emotional game. Uh, and not ending the way we wanted was, was disappointing. Uh, but again, looking back on, on the career uh, and what our class has meant to this university is, is what I try and look back to on the positives. I think we, we did a lot of good things and you know the thing I'm going to remember most is the relationship with the guys as a senior coming back um, and, and my role on the team uh, above all else what I'll remember the most. <laughs>